Welcome to the Tuesday, September 1st, 2015 edition of Vernerberry's Market Video, sponsored by the Meat Buyer's Guide Online. In today's video, processors are pushing to delay Mexico's shrimp season. Then later, we look at how stronger sales and traffic in July boosted the restaurant performance index. But first, several agriculture groups are urging delay in the waters of the U.S. rule. Here with the story is your host, Russell Barton. Following last week's federal court injunction against the new Clean Water Act rule, the National Pork Producers Council, along with other agricultural groups, strongly urged the Obama administration to delay implementation of the regulation, which would adversely affect hundreds of thousands of farmers, business people, and landowners. The NPPC also again asked the administration to withdraw it and to work with the agriculture and business communities to craft a rule ensuring the cleanliness of the nation's rivers, streams, and other waterways that the public can understand and with and which it can easily comply. For more news regarding this and other information from the National Pork Producers Council, please click on the red meat tab in Comtel. In other news, processors are pushing to delay Mexico's shrimp season. Here's SeafoodNews.com staff writer Michael Ramsing with the story. Some of Mexico's shrimp processors operating off the Pacific coasts of Sinaloa and Sonora want fishery authorities to delay the start of the season to give the stock more time to grow out to a more marketable size. A stock assessment conducted on both the inshore and offshore fisheries found that brown and white shrimp were in a small to medium sized range. The findings prompted processors last week to ask officials to push the season start date past September 9th to as late as October, a decision that Mexico's fishery reps are now expected to make in a meeting that is yet to be scheduled. Stay tuned to SeafoodNews.com for the latest latest updates out of Mexico's wild shrimp fishery and check the seafood tab in Comtel for additional market news from around the industry. Thanks Mike. Now we take a look at the National Restaurant Association's Restaurant Performance Index which posted a solid gain in July. Here's account manager Adam Sharkey with the latest on that story. Driven by stronger same-store sales and customer traffic levels, the National Restaurant Association's Restaurant Performance Index posted a solid gain in July. The RPI stood at 102.7, up 0.7% from June, and the first gain in three months. In addition, July represented the 29th consecutive month in which the RPI stood above 100, which signifies the expansion in the index of key industry indicators. 73% of restaurant operators reported a same-store sales gain between July 2014 and July 2015, up from 64% who reported higher sales in June. In addition, 59% of restaurant operators reported an increase in customer traffic between July 2014 and July 2015, up from 47% in June. For more on this and other news from the center of the plate, please visit foodmarket.com. Thanks, Adam. That concludes today's show. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Today's video is sponsored by the MAMP Meat Buyer's Guide Online, an interactive way for you to learn and understand more about the items you buy and sell. The MAMP Meat Buyer's Guide Online features high definition videos for all of your major red meat items. Head to meatbuyersguide.com to view a demo and sign up today.